Hey guys, so this is kind of something new I've started. I haven't ever really done this before and I kind of felt like I should. So for starters, my name is Danny. It's not my real name, but I will never tell you what my real name is. I don't like it. So my name's Danny. Um, Danny Callie's typically something I use. It's Danny after the Red Hot Chili Peppers. Um, Cause when you're obsessed with a band for five months, your friends give you a nickname and that was one of the only nicknames by that band they could think of that went with something. So Danny Callie the girl because Danny Callie's Danny California. Danny the girl was mentioned in the song, by the way. And then Danny's also in Californication as the Teenage Bride, but don't really talk about that one as much. Um, so this whole YouTube channel thing, and then I also have a Google Plus under the same name, and my Tumblr for this, which is mymusicsucks.tumblr.com, is kind of a place where anybody can go and, you know, you can go to get help, you can ask me questions about things, you know, just make friends, just, you know, kind of a safe kind of a safe place and like a fun place to go and kind of like so many of my favorite musicians and youtubers and whatever and so the first video I have on this channel is kind of a lot of the things I'm into right now and I watched a video today by one of my favorite youtubers shout out to Johnny Gilbert because Johnny's amazing love Johnny to death Johnny's awesome but it was the video of him talking about all of his problems and kind of stuff and I will get to that eventually on here I kind of felt like I wanted to do that and talk with you guys and this is kind of a way for me to work out Sorry, side note, I talk really fast, but this is a way for me to work out a lot of that stuff because my therapist actually told me, me talking to my posters is like a way, because I have ADD and all the stuff that comes with that, uh, it's a way for me to kind of express my feelings and to get things set out there because I don't really know how to say that to people, so I figured if I could tell you guys too, that's a bigger audience, but I want to show you guys my dorm room too if I can, it's really cool, um, it's not that special, but I'm in college now, so I'm going to show you all my posters and stuff. So that's fun. So right now you're just looking at my bed. I was doing homework. I actually stopped doing homework to do this because I thought this would be more fun. So this is my Super Chunk poster. I took a business, intro to business management class my senior year in high school. And we had to adopt a company for the semester. So I chose Merge Records. And I wrote them this super formal business email. And they sent me that poster and a bunch of other posters from fans there. And some stickers and stuff. It was pretty cool. This is all of my friends and family that I find really important. The one on the bottom right is me and my mom, and then going to the left there's me and my dad, me and my best friend Khadidra. We have the same birthday. We met in kindergarten because we were line eaters, and we're like, we have the same birthday. That's me and my grandmother, who she died of cancer like six years ago, but she's an artist and I'm an artist. She's kind of important to me. That's me and one of my youth leaders, Beth. Beth is awesome. That's me and my friend Mary Claire when we were in Chicago. when we, I was in like second grade, so I was like seven or eight. She was like six, seven, I don't know. Um, we didn't do much on that trip because we were picky. We went to American Girl though, that was cool. That's me and my friend Sydney. Always has, well, not during school, but in the summer she'll have cool hair colors or she's got an undercut right now, you know, so like she's, she's really cool. Um, those, her, that one of me and her and that one of me and Beth are graduation. That's me and my best friend Audrey. She, I have a little brother who's not mentioned in these photos because I don't like it much, but Audrey is more of a sibling to me than my brother is. And then I have these chili peppers. I bought this at the Goodwill for super cheap, but they're chili peppers. I have a chili pepper sprite like a Wraith poster, the one of them in just socks. And I was not allowed to bring it, so I brought um, the lights instead. I bought this poster in a music store downtown. It's the Kurt Cobain one. And then I have a Star Wars Return of the Jedi poster. And this bunny that my grandmother painted that she told me if it was above my head, I'd always be looked after by her. So I brought that too. Um, I have a stuffed Winnie the Pooh over here. You can't see him too well. That's an art thing I made. I don't know what's up with that. And then my posters, these other ones. So, Soul Punk by Patrick and then Andy Pierzak. Actually, I'm just going to let y'all look at these. I'm just going to hold them here and let you look. Um, they're all inspirational things. You know. But so, I'm just going to let y'all look at these. Um, pancakes and cats in your art, you know, that's a Gerard Way reference to that interview where he was like, pancakes and cats in your art, you know, like, that's what I do now, I just, and there's a place for all that in your art, you know, and so I kind of decided I liked having something random like that in your art, so you guys will now, as any of my fans and followers, I'm calling you pancake cats, because uh, me and my friend Jordan, shout out to her, she's awesome, we were talking and decided that, you know, we should, you know, do, I should have a name for you guys, and so pancake cats is what we came up with. Um, so yeah, all these quotes and pictures. I have a couple ones of Johnny. See, there's Johnny. Johnny's awesome. <laughs> um, 
major shout out to Johnny because he's cool. I'm also, uh, I'm just gonna give one shout out to Jordan and Johnny. Jordan's not on YouTube though, so that's, yeah. But I have all these posters and these inspirational quotes. There's kitty cat Johnny up there with the green iPhone. Those stickers, emo is, the emo is strong with this one. If you guys want to buy those, I am either going to set up an Etsy or a um, eBay for those so you can buy them from me. It's a spoof on the Star Wars thing. My friend, yeah, so there's that poster. My friend Norm and I were joking and he was like, pizza should remember president because it's like the only thing everybody can agree on. So I made that picture for him and then I put it out. Stuff there. There's Johnny in glasses. Um, you know, that one of Andy Bear's act. That kills me. He's so perfect in that one. Love Andy Bear's act, so that's actually another shout out there. And Anne Gerard. Okay. Shout out to all my favorite musicians, emo or not, and to all my favorite people. You know who you are. You're awesome. Yeah. I love glow stars. I have a lot of glow stars. Um, so yeah. My bed. It's kind of messy because I was doing work. And then, and then so this is my desk and it's really messy. I have a lot of things. These cute sunglasses I bought that look like lace. That's actually my great grandma. I remember my great grandfather when they met. They went to the same college I go to, and that's when they met on campus. That's when they were in college or right out of college, which is weird. See the emo stickers. Um, these you can't see any of them over the Merge Records ones that are sent me. Uh, my letter opener. Um, all my books and comic books and stuff. These are all the so these two Danger and Swimmers I bought from Burger Records. Um, the other two in that stack are mixtapes I made. I bought a patch of my I am in a record store and the whole other side I bought in the record store and then there's my Walkman. I make tapes and listen to them and then this is a card that I made. It's a going to be a musical card once I get the piece for it but it's Mama by MCR because I really like MCR and I thought that'd be cool and then it's all kind of about the aesthetic of aesthetic of Mama and of like the black parade and it's really cool and it's awesome lamp. I bought a TJ Maxx. Um, that's really kind of all I have, except for this. I'm working on that for my Halloween costume. So I showed you the BBB, the Live Bell Brides pentagram star thing. So for my Halloween costume, and I have to order the suspenders and the belt for it, and then I'm done with everything, except for when my parents ship my punk boots to me. But I'm going as Andy Beersack for Halloween, because I really like Andy, and I obviously, you know, I love Andy. My hair looks like Andy, because I like my hair this way. Um, but I'm going as Andy for Halloween, because I thought that'd be really fun. So I'm going as Andy for Halloween. Um, what I'm also going to do, guys, is in the bottom of this thing, the link to all my important social media is just going to be in the description, and so you can just, like, literally see that stuff and just, like, follow me on whatever you want to. <laughs> so, yeah, I'll give you all that important stuff. Um, also, this is my Jedi robe. I bought this at Disney over the summer because I like Star Wars. Hold on, let's look. See? I also have a lightsaber at home. And I have a bunch of Star Wars stuff. I also have a bunch of Harry Potter stuff that I didn't take with me because it's hard to take that stuff with you to college. But I um, do have it at home. But I brought my robe because it's a nice robe. We went out a couple days ago in heat to walk to CVS with my roommate to buy. We went to CVS into the grocery store to buy stuff. And it was like really hot. And maps on my phone took us through this really sketch part of town to get there when we could have just walked straight and been safe. But you know, it was fun. It was an experience. So. Walk past a cemetery, bunch of people, and you know, like old, you know, beat up, you know, like um, Buicks and that kind of stuff. So really sketch, but it was it was an experience. So that's all I'm gonna say for you guys tonight, except for that. Notice I'm in my MCR shirt, right? It's not the same one, but that video of Johnny I referenced earlier. He was in his My Chemical Romance T-shirt from the Black Parade. He was in the marching band, you know, guy one. I'm in this one, but it's funny because it's basically the same T-shirt, which I thought was really funny. Um, so in my next video, when I talk about the, um, important stuff I was going to talk about, what I'm really into and all that more, I will probably be in this shirt because it'll be like Johnny's video, which is weird, but also really cool. So yeah, um, bye guys. Hope you enjoyed this. You should do totally follow me on anything. Hope you enjoyed this. Bye. Bye my little pancake cats. You're amazing.